All right, here we have a, a new follow-up menu item here at the Outer Bank Seafood Company. What we're gonna do is a Parmesan encrusted flounder. And we're gonna bake this in the oven. It's gonna be 500 degrees. We're probably gonna take three, three and a half minutes to cook. The, um, the flounder is very simple. It's seven ounce flounder filet. You could use the white or the dark. Um, the Parmesan crust is less than an ounce. It's just the dust, the top of it. It's got some fresh herbs on it. I've hit it with a little bit of the whirl and a little bit of white wine. Oven's preheated. We're gonna throw that in and let her go. And uh, now it's in combination with the saute guy. So to finish that dish, we're gonna do a crab meat florentine, which is crab meat and spinach, sauteed with a little bit of butter and a little bit of white wine. And I'll show you that right now. Okay, here we're gonna go finish off the uh, flounder dish, which it's just about done. It's been about three, three and a half minutes. Um, I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of butter. First, I'm going to toss in my spinach, the saute pan is hot. Stir it up. Boom. Three ounces of jumbo like crab meat. See how the spinach is wilting down there? A little bit of white wine. A little bit of salt and pepper right here. That's done. That guy is now, you're just waiting on the flounder to get out. I'm gonna put some veggies down right here. I'm gonna put it down on the bottom. All right. Nice and coated. That flounder's got a lot of flavor. The breadcrumbs have soaked up that butter. The herbs are popping in there. Boom, that's it wipe off the side of the plate. And next pair of tongs. And let them see a little bit of that juice right on top. Let them see the crab meat and the spinach. There you have it. Okay, then you're gonna finish with the sriracha aioli. But boom, you got the uh, Parmesan encrusted flounder, finished off with the crab meat Florentine, grits on the side. Bon appetit.